Good day, everyone. Welcome to MAPA 5. Our lesson for today is all about the common puberty related myths and misconceptions. Before we proceed with our lesson, let's unlock first the meaning of some words. A stage of development where children's bodies and minds change to prepare for adulthood. The correct answer is puberty. A belief, story, or idea that is widely accepted by people, but is not true or not based on facts. The correct answer is myth. To give teenagers the confidence and understanding they need to manage puberty, it is crucial to clarify these myths and misconceptions with real information. Young people can be empowered by open communication and education to accept the changes they're going through and ask for help when they need it. Common puberty-related myths and misconceptions. Myth. Period blood is dirty. Fact, period blood is the same to blood from a nosebleed or cut. It is a normal bodily function for females. Various individuals believe that period blood is dirty, and menstruation is taboo in various cultures. Menstrual blood, however, is not unclean or toxic, as is commonly believed. Unless a person has a blood-borne illness, menstruation blood is not harmful. Myth. Boys and girls hit puberty at the same time. Fact. Puberty varies from person to person. However, girls often begin puberty earlier than boys. Puberty normally begins between 8 and 13 in girls and 9 and 15 in boys. Myth. If a female has her period, she cannot exercise or do physical activity. Fact. During her period, a female can do anything she normally does. Exercise can help reduce cramps and improve mood. Myth. If a female has her period, she cannot take a bath. Fact. Taking a bath will not impact the flow of your menstruation. Taking a bath during your period has a few advantages, the most significant of which is hygiene. Myth. Wet dreams aren't normal. Fact, wet dreams, also known as nocturnal emissions, occur when persons ejaculate or discharge vaginal secretions while sleeping. They are entirely normal. Wet dreams are not indicative of a health concern and do not cause any harm. Myth, acne is caused by bad food and being unclean. Fact, Although maintaining good hygiene and having a healthy diet are always vital, hormonal changes during adolescence can make acne inevitable. These hormones cause the sebaceous glands to produce more sebum as the body grows, sometimes to the point of overactivity. Acne can result from oil-clogged pores caused by excess sebum. If acne or pimples are making you feel uncomfortable or self-conscious, speak with a doctor or a trusted adult. Myth. Only boys get sweaty and smelly during puberty. Fact. Throughout adolescence, hormonal changes cause people of all genders to produce more perspiration. Not only do your sebaceous glands start to secrete oils, but these oils are also a special favorite of germs that cause odors. Myth. Puberty is scary and unpleasant. Fact. Puberty does not have to be a scary experience, and it can be beneficial. Learning about puberty so that you understand what's going on with your body can help you avoid feeling scared or overwhelmed. Many people may look forward to becoming taller or just growing up. Myth. Boys should be tougher and not show emotions. 
Fact. The assumption that boys should be quiet and not express emotion is negative and irrelevant. Boys experience a wide range of emotions during puberty, and it is critical for them to feel comfortable expressing themselves and getting help when necessary. Myth. Wet dreams only happen to boys. Fact. While wet dreams, also known as nocturnal emissions, are more common in boys, they can also occur in girls. They're a natural part of puberty and are caused by hormonal changes. Myth. Puberty ends at a specific age. Fact. Puberty is a slow process that can last several years, often beginning around the ages of 8-13 for females and 9-14 for boys and continuing into the late teens or early 20s. The exact time and duration differ from person to person. Myth. Puberty happens overnight. Fact. It could take years between the first signs of puberty and the last. Many things change and develop during puberty, but it rarely happens all at once, and especially not overnight. In fact, puberty normally lasts three to five years. While some of us may aspire to wake up three inches taller, the body does not work that way. And this is probably for the best. Myth. Only boys' voices get deeper. Fact. People of all genders may notice that their voices deepen during puberty. Some boys' voices may stand out more than girls because they have more variation and on occasion, vocal cracks or breaks. Myth. You will grow taller as soon as puberty starts to hit. Fact. Puberty does not happen all at once. It occurs in stages. Puberty is frequently characterized by many growth spurts. Some people might be delighted to grow taller, and it will happen, but it might not happen at the start or at the same time as other developments. Myth. Puberty means you won't like your parents anymore. Fact. True. Puberty is frequently a time when young people begin to seek and establish identities outside of their familial relationships. They'll want to test their own beliefs and solve challenges on their own. However, this does not imply that all, or even the majority, of young people will suddenly refuse to spend time with their parents. They'll still need their parents' help and support. Activity 1. Direction. Identify whether the following statements are myths or fact regarding puberty. Questions. What are some examples of myths or misunderstandings about puberty that you've heard about? How do you think these ideas might affect how kids your age feels about being active? Evaluation. Direction. Read the following sentences and select the letter of the correct answer. Number one, which of the following statements is a common myth about puberty and physical activity participation for girls? Letter A, exercise can slow down puberty for girls. B, girls should avoid sports during puberty to avoid stunting their growth. C, girls should engage in physical activity during puberty. D, puberty has no effect on physical activity for girls. Why is it important to debunk myths about puberty and physical activity? Letter A. Because myths can lead to misunderstandings and prevent people from being active. B. Because everyone needs to know everything about puberty. C. Because it's fun to learn about myths. D. Because adults tell us to do so. 
What can you do to help your friends understand the truth about puberty-related myths and feel more confident about participating in physical activities? Letter A. Share what you learned from the lesson with them. B. Make fun of them for believing in myths. C. Keep the truth to yourself. D. Ignore them if they have questions. Which of the following is a myth about acne during puberty? Letter A. Only eating greasy food causes acne. B. Hormonal changes can trigger acne. C. Good hygiene can help manage acne. D. Acne is common for many teens. Which of the following is a common myth about height growth during puberty? Letter A. Drinking coffee will stunt your growth. B. Most teens experience growth spurts during puberty. C. Nutrition affects how tall you may grow. D. Growth happens at different times for everyone. Good day, Remember, everyone. Welcome to right Knowledge five. Builds Confidence Let's and Let's get ready to learn and have a great By time together. By understanding the truth about puberty, our we previous become more lesson prepared was about the changes, the that, changes that, that happens up. to our body during puberty. And today we will going to compare the changes of boys and girls during the puberty stage. Good day, everyone. Welcome to MAPE 5.